Hey guys, Enters here, welcome back to another video. First things first, I'm probably playing live on Twitch right now during a $20,000 Gundam Evolution tournament. Uh, it's gonna be a 10 or 12 hour ordeal, so if you wanna catch some of that action, link is in the description. But in today's video, some surprising news in the front of Battlefield here. David Serlin, better known as Tigger, made a surprise announcement that he is in fact coming back to work for DICE. If you don't know who David Serland or Tigger is, here's a little, you know, spreadsheet for you here of what he's done. He was the multiplayer producer for Battlefield 5. He was the producer for Battlefield 1 Incursions, which was the competitive mode. He was the premium producer for Battlefield 4 Dragon's Teeth and DLC content onwards after Dragon's Teeth. He was the producer for Battlefield 4's Year 2 content and the live producer for the Battlefield 4 CTE. So, he's got a lot under his belt. I'd say the good outweighs the bad. And all things considered, this is a bit of a power move. In his comeback statement, David Serlin stated, Well, hello again, Battlefield community. I'm back this time around. Things really are different in a good way. And I'm super eager to make the future of Battlefield brighter and better than ever. Information on what actually means in more detail will spill as time goes on. But rest assured, I'm going to listen to your feedback, your woes, your ideas, and champion a game that you would love to play. See you on the Battlefield. And as far as I'm going to listen to your feedback, your woes, and your ideas, and all that stuff, the first time I ever tweeted something at him, he immediately liked the tweet and replied. And he's been replying to people on Twitter regularly, and this is great to see. Um, I've also noticed that Drunksy has been replying to people on Twitter a lot more often recently as well. And I just say that it looks as though they're trying to change some things with Battlefield big time internally. Now, as far as what David Serlin and all of them are going to be working on, I personally hope that they make him work on the next Battlefield title more than Battlefield 2042. Maybe he's not going to work on Battlefield 2042 at all. Um, I would personally prefer that. But a producer with the experience of David's level within the Battlefield franchise coming back to work on future Battlefield games, that is great for the franchise, I think. And I just hope that... This actually turns out to be something great in the future. Battlefield has been in the gutter for far, far too long, but I don't necessarily think that the rehiring of an ex-producer will drastically flip things 180. I think it'll be a gradual improvement, and I, I think it's safe to say that we've seen some gradual improvement with DICE, even with Battlefield 2042. Um, all we can do is kind of just wait and see, you know? With the Battlefield right now, and I think a lot of people are on the same page I am, I'll believe it when I see it, you know? Uh, this franchise really is at its lowest point ever, especially with Battlefield 2042 and just the way that game released. And I'll believe it when I see it, you know? I'm not going to get excited. I'm not going to get my hopes up. And hopefully, all they can really do is just do some better work in the studio and release it, and the players will have to make up their minds about it. One interesting thing that I found about David Serlin's statement is that he said, I'm back this time around. Things are really very different, parentheses, in a good way. So I, I wonder what he's saying there. That's just something interesting that I was thinking about while reading it. And of course, in the comment section down below, I would love to hear what you guys think about this particular pickup by DICE and the return of David Serlin. Will it matter? Will it do anything at all? We'll just have to wait and see. Um, sorry for the lack of content yesterday. I have been practicing my ass off for this $20,000 tournament. Um, I hope we can win. I think we can. I think our team is very strong right now. And I'll probably make a video if we do. So thank you so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. Hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Other than that, and hopefully I'll see some of you guys uh, while I'm streaming the tournament. See you guys later. Target down. Let me smash. Keep up the content. Much love.